Tiger has a tantrum. A book about feeling angry. Tiger was always getting cross. He got cross about everything. He got cross if Monkey sat in his favorite seat. He got cross if Little Lion got in his way. He even got cross if he didn't get jelly for lunch. Tiger was horrid when he got cross. He stamped his feet. He shouted and yelled. He rolled on the floor too. Everyone was scared of Tiger. When Tiger had a tantrum, everyone ran and hid. On Monday, Miss Bird gave out some new coloring pencils. She told everyone to draw pictures of the jungle. Tiger wanted the red pencil, but Hippo got it first. Tiger got cross. He snatched the pencil from Hippo. Hippo was upset. Miss Bird said that Tiger must give the pencil back. She said he had to wait for his turn for the red pencil. But he didn't want to wait for his turn. He wanted the pencil now. Tiger had a tantrum. He tipped the pencil all over the floor. Miss Bird sent him out of the room to calm down. At playtime, Tiger was still feeling cross. He wanted to play football with Lion, but Lion wanted to play basketball with Little Lion. Tiger snatched the ball and kicked it into the middle of the swamp. Lion and Little Lion were upset. They told Miss Bird. Miss Bird said Tiger had to go inside and miss playtime all together. In the afternoon, Miss Bird said that she had a nice surprise for everyone. She said they were going to visit Mr. Bear at the library to choose a new books. Miss Bird said everyone had to walk nicely in and in twos. She chose Hippo and Elephant to be the leaders, but Tiger had a tantrum. He wanted to be the leader. Miss Bird said he had to walk at the back with her and be good. At the library, Miss Bear showed them lots of books. There were big books and small books. There were flat books and thin books. There were tall books and short books. Tiger wanted the book about tractors. He liked tractors very much. He asked Miss Bear where he could find the book. Miss Bear told him to look on the shelves. She told him to have a good look. Then Tiger saw the tractor book. It was sticking out at the end of the shelf. He tried to reach it, but everyone was in his way. He got cross and began to push everyone out of his way. Miss Bird told him not to push and to wait. Nicely for his turn, but Tiger did not want to wait. Nicely for his turn, he got crosser and crosser. Just then, Tiger saw Monkey. He was taking the tractor book off the shelf. Tiger had a tantrum. He stamped his feet. He shouted and yelled. He rolled on the floor. He got so cross that he knocked all of the books off the shelf. Everyone was scared. They ran and hid. But Miss Bird and Miss Bear were not scared. They were not happy that Tiger was upsetting everyone else. Miss Bird took Tiger outside to talk about it. She told him to take a deep breath. Tiger took a deep breath. He began to calm down. He felt sad that he had made the library a mess. He felt sad that he had upset everyone. Miss Bird told him that he had to put things right. She asked him what he should do. Tiger had a think. He said he should say sorry to Miss Bear and to everyone. He said he should tidy up all the mess in the library. Miss Bird said that they were good ideas. Tiger said sorry to Miss Bear and to everyone. He put all the books neatly on the shelves. Then he sat quietly on a beanbag and waited for everyone to finish choosing their books. But he was sad that he did not have the tractor book to read. Then Monkey had a good idea. He asked Tiger if he would like to share the tractor book with him. Monkey and Tiger looked at the book together. They looked at all the tractors. They talked about them too. 
They took turns to turn over the pages. They took turns to talk about the pictures. Tiger didn't get cross at all. Miss Bird was pleased. She said Tiger was behaving nicely. Tiger said that it was more fun to share a book with a friend. He said it was better not to get cross too. Everyone cheered. That's the end of the story. Like and subscribe to our video and please press the bell icon for more notifications.